Tinder reaches out here. I didn't know that. And uh, <laughs> Tinder reaches all the way in motion. And if you know what Tinder is, it's just, don't you don't need it. It's just a greasy adult version of Duck Duck Goose. <laughs> so you have to swipe one way if you think the person's. Basically, it's an app that you have on your phone that they created, and you swipe one way if you see a picture of them. You swipe one way that says no. I don't want to bang that person. <laughs> Which, and I got into an argument the other day with the girl, she's like, I did this joke, and the girl's like, that's not what it is, it's, no, because you get girls that are like, no hookups, that's what they always write on their profiles, no hookups. You're on a site that people are judging you off the first picture, go, no, yeah, if you want it, you swipe the other way, and if you match, you start talking, and fucking eventually you get syphilis. But, that, it's not, it just don't do the Tinder thing. Tinder to me, it's just as weird, it's creepy. Uh, I am on Plenty of Fish, though. So. Now, Plenty of Fish, they should just call Plenty of Fish Plenty of Single Moms. That's what they should call. Yeah. <laughs> they should Plenty of Single Moms. It's just Single Moms and Plenty of Fish. But, I, but here's it, I'm not ragging on Single Moms. I'm not, I'm not. I dated Single Moms. I would actually much prefer to date a girl with kids than a girl with no kids, I'll tell you why. One very simple reason. Better snacks. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing, like if you're, I just love the snacks that single moms have. It's great because, like if I'm dating a girl that doesn't have kids, and I'm at her house at 3 o'clock in the morning, I get up, I'm hungry, Steve wants a snack, I go down to her fridge, she doesn't have any kids, what's she gonna have in that fridge, like an Activia yogurt? It's ah! <laughs> no fun for Steve. Like a half leftover booster juice because she's still watching her figure? No, I don't want to. A girl with kids. Oh, forget the fridge. There's a whole utopia of covers with Halloween candy going back three years. <laughs> yes, when was the last time you had a Dunkaroo, sir? I know. Dana said, come on. Here. I don't even know they still made those things. I opened up the cupboard. I'm like, fruit by the foot? Fuck yeah! <laughs> I just roll that fucker out of the Tie it around myself. Just get fucking... Just get crazy. <laughs> 